Hey guys, we're super excited to be here at the LA Fit Expo. It's our third year in a row. And uh, what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be launching the Tasty Pastry. It's a low carb Pop Tart. It's got three to four grams of net carbs. And we love this show. This is our best place to be in LA. Welcome back to Legendary Foods Muscle in the Morning. I'm Dave Palumbo and today is Friday, July 24th, 2020. And let's find out what's going on in the world of bodybuilding and fitness. At a certain point, when everyone's at the starting line, on the surface it looks like everyone begins the race with the same chance of winning. But they really don't. The truth is that there are only one or two people in that race who actually believe they're going to win. And it's that belief that makes them special. And I'd be willing to bet you anything that Terrence Ruffin believes he's one of those guys winning the race. Terrence is one of those people who just keeps finding ways to put one foot in front of the other. And when we're talking about a race to the finish, being able to do it that consistently is the only way to break the tape. I had a conversation with a buddy of mine who's really into hunting these days and he said something that was really profound that I wanted to share with you guys. He said that animals who are predators and prey behave differently. But you don't know until you're out there in nature. He said prey animals will run at the first sign of trouble, but predators don't run because they're the ones who go out and seek the trouble. And I thought that little nugget was a perfect way to sum up Hadi Shupin. The man's a natural predator, and he behaves like that too. So if I were one of his competition, I'd be keeping an eye on his movements, because sooner or later, he'll be in the mood to start seeking out some trouble. When you hear someone say, shoot or shoot, basically what they're trying to say is no risk, no reward. So if I'm Jason Lowe and I'm heading into a stacked Tampa Pro lineup, in my head I'm saying to myself, shoot or shoot, Let's go make this happen. It's been well documented that this 212 lineup in Tampa is stacked from top to bottom. But Jason was an Olympian last year and overlooking what he can do here would be a huge mistake. This guy's as underrated as anyone in the division. And I would not be surprised at all if he wound up sliding into a top three finish. Anyone who's ever built a house knows that it's way less fun than most people think. You have to deal with all sorts of unexpected delays, problems, and budget issues. But in the end, it's all worth it because you get to create your own vision from the ground up. And in some ways, building a house is the best way to describe Robert Taylor's off-season approach. The former UK champion has been rebuilding his foundation from the ground up with the idea being that he rolls out his dream version for the 2021 season. Bodybuilding is the quintessential human architecture, which means that we never really know how the finished product will look until it's time for the big reveal. And that does it for yet another edition of Muscle in the Morning. I'm Dave Palumbo reminding you to always be true to your passions and make sure to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.